up everybody your boy J Max so my boy just dropped off his bumper a couple days ago horrible condition to get painted up um, what he wants me to do is fill in the holes as you can tell fill in the holes this had a big piece for the Dyson plate same thing here shape that down I'm gonna use um, a wire mesh in the back and then fiberglass it or whatever it is this bumper is in really bad condition so let's see how good I could bring this bumper back a lot of work needs to get done to it a lot of sanding unfortunately my sander my uh, compressor isn't as big so it's gonna take twice or even three times longer and let's see what it's gonna look like Okay, so pretty much all I did is created something to be held down by the fiberglass so that it doesn't break back out. So I'm going to fiberglass all of this shit now and just put a layer of fiberglass over it. I don't have to do it with this because it's a small hole, doesn't really need it. I was doing the delete so I put on some fiberglass on it after covering up all the holes fiberglass fiberglass so this is going to require quite a bit of sanding i really can't do this type of sanding at home because the compressor i have isn't big enough to hold the volume of air but i still have quite a bit of um filling to do because you don't these things are going to show on any paint so I'm not sure what is my situation right now, but I'm going to try to do what I can to at least bring this bumper back to life. Alright, so just cleaned it up a little bit. Took down a couple of layers off of it, smoothing it out for... This, this bumper needs a lot of sanding. I cannot do this type of job with this such small compressor. So I'm just going to fill it up and neaten it up where I can. Where I can. And um, hopefully my boy is okay with that work because my compressor is too small. It's sticking way too long. It's way too hard and it runs out way too fast. Okay, so I have applied, I have did, done all the sanding and shit, um, pretty much I put on uh, primer, build up primer, I'm not sure if I had the primer too long, but it's actually starting to give off like little spots, so I guess I have a little extra sanding to do when I'm doing it, then I use what it's called a guide coat. So pretty much all this does is show, make all the low spots visible. So if I pass the sandpaper over this now, you will see like a, a sink where it hasn't been touched. So I would know for a fact that that's where I need to pretty much sand, um, fill up. But I'm probably not going to do no more filling up. I just did that just for show purposes. But I'm going to just paint this thing as it is, like sand it down. Um, clean it up a little bit more and paint it because it's a lot of work 
I don't have the oh there's a little ding here don't know if I'm gonna go clean that up but probably won't just a little ding and um, yeah I need a bigger compressor this compressor I have is not big enough to paint plus it's getting kind of cold outside and I don't think the the clear or the paint will do that well in this temperature so it had a bunch of damages here I did the license plate delete the emblem delete there was damages all at the bottom here scratches everywhere this this was actually damaged so it was folded a little bit so this is this is um, fiberglass resin sorry just short strand fiberglass I got us I primed it up so pretty much what I have to do next is probably tomorrow or some other day when I'm actually going to spray it I'm gonna scuff it down with a scuff pad and a sandpaper probably like a 320 or 400 probably like a 400 sandpaper take off the the primer actually let off I don't know if it's because it's dried it let off a bunch of these little so it's gonna make my job a little harder unfortunately I don't think the can was was dry enough uh, warm enough so it let off a lot of these little that's the unfortunate thing but not having can spray the correct temperature when it comes to spraying you always want to have it at room temperature it, it's been outside in my in my little shack that I have built here but so far this is what I've done did a pretty good job 